Hi everyone, welcome back to Nart Comics. Um, I have some books to show. Recently, um, or today I went to uh, my LCS and we picked up some dollar bin stuff. Um, I did get one thing off the wall, they had 20% off sale. Also, I had some claim sale pickups from another store, some eBay purchases, and a new book. So I'm just gonna go ahead and show everything off. So first off from the dollar bin, I got four books today. Um, this is just reading material, but we have a Dead Man number one. This is the New 52. Um, I do have that, that Strange Adventures, so I'm, I'm really interested in Dead Man right now. I do want to collect the entire Justice League Dark, so we're going to get through that. Um, I found out when I got home that this had a tear in the top, which is unfortunate. It's okay, I only paid a dollar. Uh, this is the first cameo of Godspeed. Um, I've been looking for these books. Oh, the first cameo? Second cameo, third cameo, something, some cameo of Godspeed. Um, I've been trying to find these books, but they're really overpriced on eBay. So I found this, and then also really cool. This doesn't have a tear, but does have some spine ticks. The first uh, full appearance of Godspeed. Um, so I've been looking for this. I do still want to find this in a 9-8. Um, so I'm going to keep looking for that 9-8 candidate, but it's cool to have for a dollar. And then finally... Um, the first cameo, it's not first full appearance because I know the next one's first full appearance of Impulse. Um, I was looking for that DC Universe variant, um, but I can't lie, finding this for a dollar is pretty cool. So that's the four dollar bin books I picked up. And then I also picked up, I'm working on my Fantastic Four 60 through end. Um, so I got Fantastic Four 63 for a pretty good price. Um, and then he also gave me 20% off because they're doing a holiday sale. So that was pretty cool. Um, at another shop, they do weekly claim shows. So I picked up uh, Kingdom Come, I think this is number three. Um, so now I have number one and number three. Still missing two and four. Um, but just gorgeous Alex Ross cover. Uh, so really interested in that. Um, normally I don't pick up variants, but this one, I really like this one, and it was pretty cheap. I think I paid $6. Um, ASM number four, I tend to like the trade variants better than the virgin variants. Um, if I want just like the art, I'd probably end up getting a full-size art print or a poster rather than the comic. Um, but... Yeah, I, I, I like the, because he had the he had the Virgin as well, but I, I tend to like the trades better a little bit. Um, and then finally, I picked up this. Uh, he had it for $30, which is okay. There's a couple non-color breaking spine ticks, but I couldn't find this anywhere. This is the preview teaser for Sideblade She. Uh, this is the first appearance of Witchblade. Um, after I took it out, there's a, it's a full black cover. So there are some fingerprints. Um, there's a color, couple like spine ticks, color breaking on the back. But I mean, you're not gonna find this book in the nine eight. I don't think so. I was just happy to pick this up. Um, someone is on eBay right now trying to sell this for six hundred dollars, which it's nowhere near six hundred dollars. Um, Thirty dollars was a good price to me, uh, and I've been looking for one for a while. So now I do want to get that first solo. Which blade? So that'd be fun. Um, this came out the other day. I didn't read the full thing. I didn't like it, but I did like this cover. This is the Del Auto ver or variant of um, Batman Spawn, Spawn Batman, whatever it was. Uh, this was really the only one I liked. I like that Barnes & Noble one, but I'm not paying $50 for that. Um, so I thought this was cool. This was just cover price. Um... And then I did pick up a couple things from eBay. Um, first, I, I don't know why sellers and stuff like this. This is just like, I, I, it's not, it, and then they put, please do not bend. Um, I got two books like this recently. This guy sent this media mail too. I took it off, but it's just annoying to me. Um, when I spend, it doesn't even, it doesn't matter if it's a dollar book. If I, I want my stuff like, 
in somewhat nice condition. So sending me stuff like this is kind of annoying. Um, the book arrived okay. Uh, but it is a um, Marvel Tales, number one. First appearance of Peter Porker. I kind of want to send this into the Tom DeFalco signing. Um, it's pretty nice copy. I think right now, as is, without a press, it would get a 9-0. Um, there's a little bend in the back that can be pressed out and a small spine roll. Um, so I think with all that being said, it could probably get a 9-4, um, which would be cool to have signed and in my personal collection. Um, and then I've been saying it over and over again. I'm just picking up really low spec DC keys. And I think I paid $140 for this which I'm happy with. It is off-white pages, um, but this is the first appearance of Power Girl. Um, and if you don't know who Power Girl is, she is kind of like a lesser Wonder Woman. Um, she is a pretty big deal in DC. Um, so it'll be cool to see if they do anything with her. I'm okay with the off-white pages. The guy had the same book for white off-white, but um, in the same grade, same book, it just had a really bad rap. Um, and so it was kind of cut weird to the point where you couldn't even, like, part of the, the 58 was um, coming out. Um, but, yeah, I'm fine with off-white pages. I'm not, like, as long as it's not, like, tan in a modern book, um, I'm okay with it. But, yeah, the low, I also thought it was... Um, there was some, uh, what's it called? Like a grease stain in the middle, but it's a shadow. Um, I'm looking for those low, low, like under the radar DC keys. Um, and I think Power Girl's a very, pretty popular character. So to find out that her book like this is that cheap is um, pretty surprising to me. But um, yeah, I was excited to pick this up and uh, I'm excited to add this to the personal collection. But that's everything I picked up recently. Um, I do have some more stuff coming in. We're going to do our Christmas, excuse me, exchange. So you'll see what Parker and I got each other. But that's everything I picked up. Thanks for watching.